So when comparing coronavirus to the flu, what we're talking about is comparing um, coronavirus to an orthomyxovirus or influenza. And so there are some differences between these viruses that separate them, and so they are not the same thing. The influenza virus is an RNA-based virus as well, but it is made up of eight different RNA segments that make up its genome. And so given the right situation, there can be an event where the chromosomal um, segments um, go through a reassortment. And in doing so, you get an exchange of genetic material, and now your human flu, your bird flu, your swine flu can all be um, recombined and rearranged so you get a new virus coming out every year. And that is called um, a genetic shift, and that's where we get our pandemic flu. The coronavirus, on the other hand, is a single um, piece of RNA, and so it doesn't have that ability to swap out and become totally new every season. The differences in the virus also explain why our flu drugs don't work against um, coronavirus. So the most popular um, flu drug is um, Tamiflu, right? And that is a, a drug that inhibits the um, ability of the flu virus to escape from the cells. And that is a very specific interaction um, with neuramidase and sialic acid. And so that is not at all the process that the coronavirus uses to get into and out of cells. Um, the coronavirus gets into cells by um, its own special protein known as the spike protein or the S protein, and that protein um, interacts with a completely different unique receptor that is expressed on your lung, lung cells. And so that is how it is able to interact. And at that point, that lipid bilayer is able to fuse with your human membrane and allow the RNA to um, enter the cell. And so we need to have different drugs that target um, areas that are specific to um, the coronavirus um, replication cycle or the coronavirus um, binding or assembly that are gonna be completely unique from say the influenza virus.